All right. Here we are. I'm Danny. I am here with Rob. Howdy. Hey, Rob. That's that's a file. That's two and a half hours in. So this is the file that we left off on last time. This should be no surprise to you, audience. We're playing uh, Imposter Factory. Sorry, I, d I didn't want to keep you guys waiting on the answer to what we're playing. <sighs> so, so... <sighs> Frick. So, I, I since last we recorded, I've edited the first video of this series. And if you guys saw that video... You guys saw we had technical difficulties. If you guys saw episode two, you probably saw that we also had technical difficulties. Mostly related to my goofs. Those should all be fine now. Everything, everything should be fine. Now. Now especially. Things should be peachy. Things are definitely peachy. I hope to God. So yeah, that's all fine. Me, though. I'm not fine. Because, you see, I was editing. It was editing, Rob. Rob doesn't know what I'm about to talk about now. But I'm about I to don't. go on a rant. So I'm very sorry for eating up your well-deserved video time, viewers. You can skip this if you want. Uh, and I, I wouldn't... I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be mad about it. That's probably for the best. Maybe I don't want anyone to see this. I don't know. I don't even know if this is making it into the video. Because I'm just going to talk. I'm just going to talk. And this doesn't matter. And it might not be a long talk. And it might be a long talk. And it might not. And it probably won't be. Or will it? I don't know. I I haven't planned. I was going to talk about this. At, I was just going to shove it. Future Danny. I was just, just going to shove it at the end of episode one or two. Right? Because I was editing the video. And I, I, I joked. I was joking last episode. But it just hit me. It hit me hard. And then... The ramifications hit me hard, and my conscience hit me hard, and I've been through the four stages of grief in the past, like, 48 hours, and I've just been reliving all four of them. Why four? Because I haven't reached acceptance once, and I am currently in depression right now, but I'll be, I'm, I'm just looking at the screen, boy am I gonna be in anger, always in anger, I am. So, Rob. <laughs> yeah? What do you think the deal is? I... Here, I'm going to say this quite clear. Audience, honestly, if you don't want spoilers, I'm sorry. Because what I'm about to tell you is 100% true. How do I know that? Because I believe it so hard. And I, be I believe, without a shadow of a doubt, that Linry is Fae. Okay. Without a shadow of a doubt, and it pisses me off, and it makes me sad and angry, and it's... She has fucking green eyes and brown hair, Rob. And I know that sounds crazy. <laughs> That's that does sound crazy. But I it's true. <laughs> these these game you're working with sprites here. You're working with sprites, Rob. And you're gonna have you're gonna tell me the main female character of this game is gonna have the exact same freaking eyes and hair color as the main female character of the last game. You're gonna tell me that in all the marketing materials for this game, you did not once show the eye color of this character once. I we 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 I believe this is a simulation, Robert. And that that's we have Neil, and we, we I we have Neil and Ava, and and 
but last the last game ended and there was Faye and Faye was in it and so if this is a simulation then and if it's being made by Neil and Ava then Neil's machine has Faye in it and where's Faye right in front of us Rob <laughs> Huh. It's my favorite character. And it was Linry. And I'm pissed. <laughs> and I can't I... convince you. I can't convince anyone. It's fine because I know in my heart of hearts that it's true. And if it's not, I won't be surprised. I am still, however, 100% certain that I am correct. I don't think you are because that's balls to the walls a stretch i i'm so right it hurts and it's gonna hurt me for the entirety that we're playing this game for very selfish reasons i will continue to suffer until i see for a fact that i am wrong but this will not happen well, hope, hopefully you'll realize that you are very quickly. I, I've, and maybe you are right, but I, if you are right, then it was by luck. Cause there, I, it is no, 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 Rob. I read into the code, the matrix. Luck my ass. <laughs> Love I... my ass. Use meta magic, Rob. Read around the lines, in the lines, through the lines. Stop looking at stop looking at clues, Rob. You what what are clues? Clues are nothing. Clues are useless to you. Forget about them. Doesn't dude talking to the police officer also have brown hair and green eyes? No, and, uh, I, he's I, oh, wearing a police cap. No, the dude next to the police officer. Like, uh, uh, Victor. No, he's Victor. <laughs> Linry is Faye. Don't you understand the, this? I... The, de the the murder victim and the woman in the purple dress have the same hairspray. I, I don't think it's that deep. I think it's so deep. <laughs> I think it's so deep. You don't in even fact, know. In fact, the dude on the right of the police officer has the same hairspray as the other murder victim. So deep. I'm... Look, Rob... Rob... Robbie... The, Robbo... Bob... The, Chad... The amount of assets reused in this game is astounding. For the main two characters? <laughs> I... River... Had... Orange hair... I rest my case. I need say nothing more than that. Everything else was implied. All right, I let's play the game because I want to get to the point where it is revealed that Libri is not <laughs> Faye as quickly as possible. I am confident. I'm so confident, Rob. And Rob, I, I want nothing more to be wrong, and I will be so much happier than you when I'm wrong, <laughs> but I won't be. It's not a when. If I were wrong, I would be more overjoyed than you've ever been in your life. I, my suffering is tremendous. I am suffering for the sake of all others, and I hope that something about my current circumstance can do some good for another poor soul, because it is not doing any good for me. I, I mean, honestly, I... Uh... The, this the only difference between this like the this is so much of a stretch and the only comparison between the <laughs> two that I think is viable is the fact that they're both the best character in their respect. They are games. they are the best character. 
in their games. It's because it's the but... same character! It's the best character in the series! <laughs> I... Uh... I I don't I don't My think brain's so. so big. I'm I'm a god. I now don't get me wrong, I think Faye is in this game, and I can't wait for the reveal that Faye is someone else. But, uh... <laughs> Ooh, I can't wait for that too, Rob. <laughs> this this, if I am right, this might single-handedly ruin the game for me. Except it won't. Oh. It won't ruin it from an objective standpoint, but it certainly will from a subjective standpoint. Because if it's right, I... if I have to deal with the fact that I believe that I'm right until the last episode of this series, I will have suffered so much. <laughs> you cannot change oh. my mind. I cannot change my mind, and I want to. I want to think like a different person. Who isn't Danny? Who's like Rob? And I've never wanted to be like Rob in my life. No offense, Rob. <laughs> well, see, now I'm curious. Okay. Hypothetically, in this wrong universe where Faye is Linry, why is that a bad thing? For very selfish reasons. <laughs> it's fine, because no matter what, I'm right. Even if I'm wrong. Mm. I win no mm. matter what. I No matter what, I will gain more from this series than you ever could. And I'm happy about <laughs> I, that. We, we, you've put yourself into a scenario where, like, the only way you win is if you're wrong. Because if you're, if you're right, then you more than likely than not won't get any satisfaction from being right. No, well, I will get satis- no, that's the only kind of satisfaction I might get. I won't get satisfaction from being right. The only satisfaction I'll get is from being right against all odds. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you'll you'll have the satisfaction of being right with an evidenceless Hail Mary. If you want me to be but... honest, you want to hear another crackpot crazy? Okay, well, what's your, your crackpot crazy? Basi so you have to understand this. In all reality, I'm actually not. I am actually think that it's likely also that Linary isn't Faye. And I know that sounds right. crazy to say. Um, I mean, but, but it makes sense. But the reason this is is because they do have different hair tones. And I know that's a crazy... That's crazy to be my only reason. <laughs> that's wild that that is your only reason. My, Well, we don't know jack crap about Linry except that she's quirky and in this simulation. You know? And you know who else is quirky and in this simulation? Faye. And also has green hair and brown... Green hair... Yeah, green hair and brown eyes. You know? Because who, who cares? Um, um, and so there's not a lot uh, of evidence. And so basically I'm like... This game could and hope and should immediately disprove me by just revealing anything about Linry. Just anything. Or, or Faye, because like I said... Or, Faye, earlier, or if I Faye do, just showed I, up. Yeah, I do think Faye will just show up in this game based on how the last game ended. I agree. Uh, um, but Well, I, I, don't, I, I don't know, dude. I'm like... But, but here's the thing. It's like, if Faye isn't one of these characters, and maybe Faye's not, again, technically we don't know the rules to Faye. Right. But it's like, Ava looks like whatever her name is. I think her name started with a V. Via? Something like that? Uh, uh no, Rika. Rika. Uh, I associate V and R both with purple, so anyway. Um, mm -hmm. That tracks. Um, But like... I, so it is canonical that this machine has the possibility I'm sorry if honestly this might also be in the video if it is again I'm so sorry you can skip ahead <laughs> um, uh, but uh, ooh. What, so, so basically it's like because of this rabbit hole I was looking at a bunch of stuff 
basically it's like you know you know i was looking at like the art for the, like you know the t title art for Poster factory and how like the eye color for lid like that that was like making me so paranoid. I'm like, why why didn't they show her face at all? <laughs> like, <laughs> and you have to keep in mind. Actually, this helps for cultural context. I haven't gotten more than five hours of sleep in the past five days, audience. Um, so <laughs> this was on like day three of that, um, and I'm still pretty uh, bad. But uh, I basically was like. Well, what's hair color? What what are what's her eyes? They're they they were green, hair color. And I was like, well, who like if if a character can like if Neil if we're saying that Butler guy is Neil and he's changing his hair color, why wouldn't Ava do it? Like, I I feel I've become just as confident that they aren't Neil and Ava. I think it's still very possible, especially with Rika. Rika feels sus as hell. Uh, but I'm like. Except for the fact that they're a pair, it's like there's no Mister Mister Butler guy doesn't seem like Neil in any obvious ways, except for honkers my bonkers maybe. But this game is pretty honkers my this series is pretty honker honkers my bonkers. So you know, yeah, could freaking Lewis exists? Is his name Lewis or Louis? Um, oh, I I think it's Louis. Louis's better. That's right. Um, Louis Chegg. Julie Chegg, yeah, that's a good, good last name. Um, yeah, this the game's pretty honkers my bonkers. So at this, basically, I'm having an existential crisis about this video game, Rob. I believe that nothing's real. <laughs> and I know we already knew that. But, like, for me, it's in a spiritual way. <laughs> right now. Okay. So anyway, where were we? How you doing, Rob? Where... I'm doing wild. <laughs> this was not... I, I, I texted Rob the same night that I had this, like, big revelation. And basically, it was like, Rob, I'm miffed. And I, I really, unintentionally, because I hate hyping things up. It's, but it sucks when I feel such strong emotions. Strong, beefy, muscular emotions. Ooh, they're so strong. But, uh, it's like, I didn't want to overhype things, but I'm like, I know fully well that I'm going to sound like a crazy person. <laughs> and, and I already do, and it's like, there's no way for me to, to me to, like, get your expectations in order because i feel insane oh i've got my expectations in order don't you worry <laughs> all right don't act all don't act all cocky here uh <laughs> i'll cut you out of this series <laughs> how dare you oh oh it's fine let me be wrong in peace okay <laughs> Let me enjoy being wrong, if and when it I, happens. When it happens, I will let you enjoy being wrong. But uh, until it happens, it's a bit. <laughs> That's fair. That's fair. <laughs> um, what are we supposed to do? We can go to the bathroom. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Because we were sh we were showing her. Yeah, me we were, too. We were <laughs> me showing too, her the see. sink. I've, I've, you, literally, this has been eating at me for the past few days to such an extent that I accidentally called a co-worker Quincy today. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, there's one problem. This, wait, is this... This That's is me, you. right? God, I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm losing my mind. Stay away! <laughs> Uh, let me try. Hey, are you all right in there? Go away! I'm not letting anyone in until my bodyguards get here. That's fine, I'm leaving. Could you just knock on the door every five minutes or so, though? What? Why? 
Just so we know you're alive, of course. I mean, you're all alone in there. If something happens, nobody would know. <laughs> and who knows if there are other entrances? Those singled out are easy targets, after all. In fact, this murder podcast I was just listening to the <laughs> other day said, Hey, yeah. Adina. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. The second I saw the, um, the friggin' hyphen there, <laughs> I was there. like, I know what's gonna cut that out. <laughs> Why do you listen to murder podcasts? It's complicated. It's weird not to be doing like an old person voice constantly at the beginning of one of these games. True. All right. That's going to come gonna... back. The murder podcast. Yeah. It's only murders in the building. <laughs> okay, these aren't going to be anything. Hello. <laughs> I'm behind Is this you. This is this the sink you were talking about? Yeah. Alright, go ahead. No. <laughs> I'm gonna leave. Is my sprint button not working? <laughs> <laughs> so aren't you going to show me how this works? What, you're afraid Faye's gonna appear out of the sink? Terrified. <laughs> I'm, I'm terrified about it. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm coming. Um, you know, I, but I, I remembered I did all this for like finding paradise, right? I, is the sprint button just not work right now, or am I going crazy? The sprint button was Shift S, right? It was, or just Shift, I think. Well, yeah, just Shift in general. Yeah, and it's. But yeah, that's. I'm just gonna assume. But that's. Keep in mind that's also that's also what killed the recording last time. Oh, I changed the hotkey for. Uh... Oh, okay, good. I, I don't cool. don't you worry about that. Danny has learned. <laughs> Are you going to do it? Sorry, I'm just afraid that Faye will show up. I'm gonna do it. Gosh. I actually will wait. <laughs> What? You can't wash your hands with <laughs> someone watching? Um, I, I I remember I did like all the recording the video stuff for the first few episodes of Finding Paradise. This video isn't nearly as clean as those. I was so like tired during it that I made so many mistakes. <laughs> like There were times that I would enter a cutscene prematurely and just have to sit on the first line of dialogue until we caught up in the video. Uh, or just go into the wrong room and start talking to the wrong person and be like, oh, I can't repeat this dialogue, so I either have to, like, skip this dialogue and not be able to view it later or whatever. So I'm sorry to all those affected by that issue. No, it's it's just, uh... Do you mind if we do it together? Ooh, dramatic Why? music. I mean, maybe that way there's more of a chance we'd both travel in time. I don't really know how sync-related time travel works, but I'm just tired of being the only crazy person every time I come out of this bathroom. Mm -hmm. This better not be some convoluted scheme to try something weird with me. I'm a pervert. Mm -hmm. Don't flatter yourself. There are corpses outside, and I'm not in the mood. <laughs> Ooh, Quincy. This is the sassiest thing Quincy's ever said. Well, come on. This is the same guy who at the beginning of episode one is like, this is how some romance stories start. <laughs> Upon arriving at a mysterious mansion with no recollection of anything. True. We, I think we sometimes forget that Quincy fully has amnesia and hasn't realized it yet. Right? Wait. What are you doing, man? What? Just in case this doesn't work. Can you tell me a secret so it's easier to convince you that we've met before? You're sounding more and more sketchy by the I like that they added the eye squint sprites to this mm -hmm. one. Really adds a lot. I... I, I know. <laughs> Lavender. Huh? Just Lavender. Okay.
Wait. <laughs> what? You you said you met me in these other supposed timelines? Yeah, I thought you don't believe this. I don't, but never mind, look, I'm just curious. What did I say to you? Well, we didn't really talk much, but... Oh, you did say there was something that you wanted to ask and show me. Yeah, good Quincy, that's not sketchy. That was the first time I saw you, I think. Hmm. I wonder what the hell is these two characters' deals. Yeah. Because... If we're assuming this is all simulation and that Quincy's the subject, or... Because, again, when I play these games at this point, ever since Fighting Paradise, we've gotten so conspiratorial. Oh, I haven't even mentioned See. half the things I've brushed upon. I also <laughs> thought that maybe Linry's the subject of all this, potentially. Or maybe they're both the big... real people. I hate to break it to you, Danny, but the big reveal is going to be that Faye is Quincy. <laughs> I'd, I, I would feel fine about that. <laughs> <laughs> I would be fine with that. Um, that that's that's best case scenario, honestly. <laughs> that's what I'm rooting for now. That's my new mo. Uh, but I've also thought like, is Linry a real person then? Because it's like this isn't this this doesn't seem like the normal setup of like a normal um a normal like Neil and Ava um doing timey-wimey things. Usually it's just the course of someone's life has changed. And usually, yeah. like, everything flows together neatly. Like, subjects, I, I assume, aren't meant to just, oh, I went to the moon by gaining amnesia of everything, and now I'm on the moon. You know? <laughs> it's like, yeah. there's logic to these, and there's nothing, there's, ver everything here is crazy. <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, something crazy is happening here. And then, like, they're giving enough attention to Linry where it's like, well, I feel like a, a part of me is like, well, Linry can't be a fake person, right? Probably. Unless Linry is. Unless Linry is an AI. Well, well, here's the thing, is we're assuming that this is one of the, one of the, the Stigcorp memory whack things, so... <laughs> right, because maybe it's so... not... Well, because, like, I I think that it's probably everyone in this mansion is someone that Quincy knows. Yes. <laughs> I, to, I, to, I agree with that to an extent. But also then, also I guess also the question is, why the hell is any of this happening? And I know this is all stuff that will get revealed because it's a video game, and we know that these games. Yeah, work. I. But I can't uh, stop myself from thinking about it. You know, it's like what the, this is the weirdest setup we've got in one of these. It is wacky. What? It has me. This game, the, the last game broke me. The last game, it's twists in conjunction with this game's beginning broke my expectation brain. <laughs> Like I, I feel uh, right man. about everything and wrong about everything. Like, and, and I'm pissed because I feel like I'm thinking of every out of the box, crazy, stupid solution that could possibly be, and the answer's gonna come and it's gonna hit me in the face, and I'm gonna be wrong, <laughs> unless I'm right, which would be I, the worst case scenario. And I don't want to be right. <laughs> I I can't wait till we get to that point. Like, I'm so scared when the one piece of text box shows up that hits me in the face, you know? Yeah. Because it's, it's going to be that one clip. It's going to be that one face suddenly has a black freaking, like, holes in her face <laughs> clip. Yeah. And there's a random motorcyclist in the real world. Remember that? Remember that plot thing that happened? Remember how remember how in the To the Moon DLC, Ava shows up at the end of it wearing a Sigmund Corp headset? Now at the end of the original To the Moon game, Dr. Watts looks in the horizon, you see the red flash of the screen as if he's in a simulation at that moment or something. 
We'll we'll figure it out. We'll find out the no, answers. No, we won't. We They'll figure it out. They'll show us it. They'll be like, "Fuck you." Here's the answer. This is it. And you, all the pieces were there, and you didn't do it. You, you uh, idiot. And, and then I'll I, be like, mm. I would love that, honestly. It's gonna be great, Rob. It's gonna be so good. This is, this is gonna be such a good game. It is. It's going to be a very good game. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Oh. Ah. Sorry. Sorry, audience. <laughs> I hope you skip. <laughs> Any idea? Not a clue. Okay, let's get this over with. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lindry. Right. Or should I say Faye? Or should you say Linry? I, I actually, that's I don't know why I'm phrasing that as a question. You should say. <laughs> Wait. What? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Never mind. I forgot what I was gonna say. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Wait. That's something I'd expect Linry to do. It happened. Yay, Linry's part of the party now. Is something supposed to happen? Yeah, there was a sound effect. Didn't you hear it? I don't know. I guess maybe it already happened. The last few times, I just turned on the water and washed my hands like this. Closed my eyes like this. Oh, no. Then I opened my eyes and, and walked outside. Gone. Frick. Linry? God damn it. <laughs> I just want to drop an F bomb. <laughs> <Hey. laughs> ah, <laughs> I thought we were making progress, finally. Well, we do uh, have lavender, right? That's a thing. Yeah, let's go oh, find Linry. Uh, video's going to end soon, and we'll have done very little. I'm very sorry, audience. It's fine. The next video will have more stuff in it. It will, I promise. I, I've done all my mind losing. It's been reset again. I guess I'm the only one who can use the sink after all. At least it's easier to talk to Linry now. They should still be at the party room. Unless they're not. Oh, Unless right there's already, already dead bodies in, in there. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what? Hello? Unless you're gonna pull just a random twist. That light, it's so bright. Where's it coming from? Was there a light fixture on there? What are you... What? What the... What? Wait, what? The light moves with us. Yeah. What is this? What's this bull crap? What's under the sheet? And why is it a Sigmund Corp headset? And why is it probably not? Why do you hate me so, game? Well, let's let's ch check the clock. Because no one's here, so it might just be earlier. It's never been more than a... Well, no, there was one time where we got an exact time. It was like a little past three or something. Or not a little past three. It was like 3.22, right? Or 3.25. Is this yeah. the time that it was that one time? Maybe? It was, I thought it was 22. It might have been. I don't know, but I feel like the specific times are important to remember. Yeah, there's no there's no umbrellas in yet, which means no one's here. Not even us. What? Our umbrella's in there usually, at a minimum. Why is... What? Them too. What is this? Are we going to get plot reveal? I don't know. It's it's doing the ominous music. Fresh garlic. Did I hear Rob? Hmm. God, it's Pizza Hut garlic. 
Yeah. The doors. That door. What is with It's gonna that? be sauce. It's gonna be sauce. You know it's gonna be sauce. Which is why I check it first. Be... Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, also, odd thing. Yeah, I know, Quincy, you're having a mental breakdown. In the first episode, we try to touch the fire and the screen flashes red and goes like, ooh, pain. And I'm like, and that's definitely something. Like, why did we touch the fire? Why like, why would that have been an option, right? Usually you don't interact with things. Like, why? But I don't see why they would just be like, yeah, there's an interaction where you touch the fire when you talk, when you talk to it instead of it just saying something that it's a fire, you know, like it does with every other object. I think that's a hint at something. I don't know what. It's the same red screen flash that happens to, like, Neil at the end of the thing. The first well, game. Well, I... I... Yeah, I think we can just assume that the red flash indicates pain. Yeah. But also, why would we touch the fire is just my question. It just feels weird. But maybe it's not important. Uh, there's a bunch well, of dead bodies. This doesn't phase me. Yeah. Uh, what? What is happening? Oh, I'm sorry. He's supposed to be surprised. What's, ha what's happening? Oh. I don't understand it. W what is this? And then Linry comes down around the corner with a comes knife. down the chimney in a in a Santa <laughs> Claus outfit. Oh, I can move. The door won't open. Oh, also, I discovered something while replaying that the audience has seen and we haven't actually. Well, I have. In that scene where Linry's telling us to bugger off at the beginning, remember because she has something she needs to do. Which, by the way, we still don't know what yeah. that was. We went down, because I was trying to be sneaky and slick, and we went to the cat room. Fun fact, I couldn't have left it this way if I tried, because the door wouldn't have opened. Oh. So, huh. railroads, okay. am I right? I think they're yeah. slow. Yeah. I can't run, so. I'm going even slower than normal, I think. I don't think I can talk to any of these bodies. Yeah, I, I, think, I think we just keep on schmoovin'. The game's not even trying to let me have agency. The game's like, Danny, shut up. <laughs> Alright, is there something crazy down here? I'll take something crazy. What is this feeling? What is this feeling? I don't know, man. Why is what? Holy shoot! Oh. What? Uh. Wait. What? We could probably go out cat door. Door is locked. I know. Yeah, no, because the what light. The, no, there's a light now around the top door, so I think it's open now. Dude, I hate the music. Uh, okay. Was that the door? Oh, wait. Why, why were we able to schmooze before? Wait, what if I go back I... to this door? <laughs> I, I, I don't... Rob, you can't stop me, okay? What? I know I can't, but I can at least the vo voice that I know there was nothing with the door. I'm going to cut all your audio out of the video. <laughs> <laughs> and the and the main reason all those thirst traps at home are watching oh, I can sprint again oh everything's just normal now why do I just go downstairs is the whole house filled with dead bodies now probably so did Quincy see these two are these two people like Quincy's parents or something and he saw them like die in real life or is, is this like a traumatic thing? Maybe Quincy murdered them in real life. Oh, that that also sounds like a tw Oh, they're not in here, though. Keep the blood out of the kitchen, I guess. But they are in here. Okay. feel like it wouldn't have been too much extra trouble to also put them in the kitchen, but props to you for respecting the kitchen, I guess. 325, that feels like an important time. Especially if we're talking about murder here. 26, okay, so time's progressing. Alright, so I reset do we, again. 
Yeah, we bathroom. What's happening? Whoa. What was that? What? What is what is happening to me? What is happening to me? Oh no, Danny. This is trippy as frick, but this is also really cool. Are you gonna wash your hands, Quincy? What the? Yeah, why not? Why not? Um. Uh, um. Even just one of you was enough trouble as it was. Oh, do you do you remember what's what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay. Whoa. What the pug? A thing Quincy says. Hey, wait. Okay. We got a hunter down. I know we got. Unless a you want to. Well, you wanna actually, we might want to end the episode. <laughs> That, this one would make a good stopping point. Yeah, we're definitely at that time. I'm very sorry, audience. My deepest condolences. It's fine. You can wait seven days. <laughs> oh, Ken Gao, you jerk. <laughs> All right, well, like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for tolerating this video. Let us know. Give us a crackpot theory in the comments. Something real stupid. Something real dumb. Like Linry being will... Faye. Yeah. I'll be reading them. I always do. Don't worry. It's no. It's not a lot of work. I'm gonna hit my head against the wall. Have a good one, folks. Take care. That's a wrap. Thank you.